Hey folks, Quilly Team here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Crusader Kings 3. We are the Extra Life Dynasty. We are still ruling as Count Gilvoro of Santiago. Unfortunately, only a single county currently, but maybe that'll change because we are currently fabricating a claim. Fingers crossed that uh, exciting possibilities open up here. I don't know exactly what it's going to look like to declare war on this person with the like duchies and things that are going on. Okay, we're going to spend the money. <clears throat> so I can now, ah, uh, it would be declaring war on Infante, and I was worried about that. Although, they have no allies, I have allies. Well, I can re-war for Tui, but presumably my claim on that will stick around, whereas the, the claim here might not the same. Oh, interesting, there's a different cost. I wonder why there's a difference in cost here. Okay, I'm going to do this and I'm going to call in my... Oh, they are distant allies. I have, um, hmm. Right, so my alliance with the king doesn't matter. I don't know if this is my actual combat strength. No, this is assuming I call in all my allies, which I don't have right now. Okay, let's not immediately start the war then. Let's create... We do have the men at arm regiment with the bowmen, which is sitting at a three of three. But I think we're going to throw in some more. And I'm thinking I'm just going to throw in some light footmen. Can I get a preview of what kind of troops they'd have? Bowmen, light horsemen, light footmen. Okay. So. There you go. Counter, light cavalry, heavy cavalry. The bowmen counter skirmishes, skirmishers, which are what the light footmen are. Yes. Um, the light horsemen, which we know these guys are going to be packing, will counter the bowmen, but maybe only if they can reach them. Should I get some pikemen? I mean, it only counters the cavalry, though. Maybe we just get more light footmen. The cheap, big numbers... And just keep the archers protected. Unless I throw in my own light horsemen as well in here. Um, oh, I guess one more question I've got is, what does my full composition look like? Uh, but this will include the other stats. Can I find out right over here? Yeah, it's just levies and bowmen. And then I've got my ally strength, but... I guess it makes sense. Just levies and bowmen. My levies are going to have some combination. Okay, I'm going to get some light footmen in here. I'm going to max this out. Let that grow. I want some more bodies. And I don't want to be as dependent on the um, levies here. So, I guess we're not saving up for that cathedral after all. Yeah, I can always declare war on the Sultan over here, but that would be pretty terrible. Oh yeah, so he bends the knee there. Um, should I fabricate a claim maybe over here? Because I don't think... I think when we started fabricating this, I think it belonged to this guy. But then something flipped, and it actually... Our situation got much worse. Uh, let's do a normal treatment. The other thing I could do is I could fabricate here. It's going to take three years. Well, get started on it anyway. my dynasty. Oh, nice. Okay, so my daughter, Ghost Girl SA, has given birth to a son. So, we're gonna grab some dynasty. It's it's mixed flicks! Or just flicks, I think, is the way they prefer to go by. Bam. Mixed flicks. Okay, you're building up. The levies haven't even uh, fully restocked yet, actually, from the uh, war that I helped defend the king with. Going well again, that's good. So I'm at two of two. All right, slipping away. What is this? Caster seems difficult time, latest thief. Oh, is she's impatient, or I could flip her to shy or gluttonous. I'm gonna leave her there. I'm still stressed out like crazy here. I don't think the pilgrimage helps reduce that. It's all money. It would be terrible if we had a stress generating event right now. It would be really bad. 
perk embassies. Each alliance gains plus one toward diplomacy skills, so let's do that. Um, woo, you're about to come of age. Sort by alliance power. Try to go matrilineal if we can. Oops, go back to alliance power. Uh, an earldom. So it's, it's all it's all pretty tiny. These have counties. Earldom. Well, you're lowborn. You even got claims. Okay, we're gonna go for this. We have our dynasty. My god, this party's boring. Esteban has to got to be the worst host the world's ever seen. A can mortal man be expected to endure snoring celebration of mediocrity? My eyes cast about the room, looking for diversions. Any diversion. Uh, this jerk ass gives me a friendly wave. Gotta do something to stop it. I have a dance. Again, a hook on Esteban. Everyone would like me. Get to know him better. Well, I can't do something that generates stress. That would be terrible. Let's just have a dance. Bring the party to life. Uh-huh. Got a favor hook on someone. Which might matter. Wait, I do, I do have lack of control. It's a hundred control. Sending a marshal to increase control of the county, Santiago, lead to less county corruption. Oh, will it prevent these things from spawning? Oh, you were assigned there. The thing is, if we're gonna start a war, oh my god, it's gonna take eight years. Yeah, um, we're gonna go back to organizing levies for sheer strength. Increase control. Lost unsafe highways. Did it? Did it purge that right away? Oh shit! Now we got county corruption and another thing. Well. Their stewardship just triggered this. So that's unrelated to what we were just doing. The fact that we have a ship steward. Oh, come on. All right, and we have low levies, so I guess we do have to keep you here. Because the low control will hurt the levies. All right, two years to go. Sure. I don't know, maybe we'll just end up with the claim that was fabricated over here and we'll, or on Pravia. The White Heart. Days pass, I hear nothing about it. Um, a sun tasty sauerkraut. He gained distracted for 10 years. 10 years. Ooh, that's pretty bad. No, no. Let's send a missive. See what we can do. Now, if this fellow finds himself in a war, it might be a good time to trigger things. Yeah, he's allied to the king as well, so I guess our alliance wouldn't have helped there regardless. The trouble fulfilled. There we go. Wootrax comes of age. Becomes a fortune builder. Gets married. Okay. We do have three alliances, which is giving me various stats and things, which is still good. Okay. His hook on me has expired. How's our claiming? Okay, 21 more months over here. Control growth is still happening. Okay, smuggling ring went away. Oh, Wolfhild given birth to a daughter! Let's get a new name. We've got the Harbinger of Chaos. That might be too long. Nope, it's not. The Harbinger of Chaos. Welcome to the family. Oh, scheme at court. Someone's gonna m try to mur murder Rodrigo. All right. Anything better I can do for my council here at this point? Not really. At least, I mean, people aren't terrible anymore, so at least we've got that going for us. This mayor is still cranky that she doesn't have a position, but she sucks. Um, Tasty Sauerkraut's already in a good position. I could put Ghost Girl as a spy master. She would actually have two extra points. All right, let's do that. Lovely. Find secrets. With find secrets, I could potentially then forgive them about it. I don't know. I don't know. Disrupt schemes, I think, is still okay. There's no one to murder. Well, what if we did murder this guy? I mean, it's pretty low chance. If we had a ton of money to bribe people, it might work better. But that would be interesting because it might cause some realm breaking up. 
Well, I mean, he's still a duchy title, so less so, but might still weaken him. Yes, let's absolutely run a feast, because we need to burn some stress. We do get more burnage. Like, we get reduced, theoretically, because we're diligent, but we get the boost here because Gregarious and Eager Reveler. So we're halfway down. That's really helpful. Um, deserves all the credit. We don't want to do anything to boost um, stress. We've got our secret stores of booze. Uh, we do really have a lot of prestige. Sauerkraut increases prowess by two. Yeah, you can become Gregarious. That's all right. Um, I will exchange letters with you. And... All right. The latest gossip. Tell me about poisons. You do have in in higher intrigue than me. Well, I mean, you have... You ha intrigue's your best stat. Tell me about poisons. Yeah, well, he's proud. I thought he was going to say, like, I can't believe you would dare say something like that, but... Let's keep exchanging letters. Hey, we got the 300 this time. So we, the last time we got 100 points. So, foreign affairs, shorter truces. Well, let's grab Ducal Conquest. We might be lucky enough to, like, actually get a title going. Okay, finishing the claim there, which is going to cost us money. Hey, Wootrax gave birth to a daughter and was going to name her after herself. But we are going to override that, and you are now... Your daughter's going to be called Indecisive! Okay. Let's see it done. We are going to go into debt. But I want the claim here. Now, we obviously can't fight the war if we are in debt, because that's quite poor. We can't even declare war while we're here. Um, I think the control was finished. Yeah, you're back over here. Control's back there. We will get back in the black soon. All right, speed up. Fletcher Reed comes of age. War declared on liege. Well, I'm not going to get involved in this one because I don't want to spend my troops. Although he might, you know, raise some of them regardless. Uh, let's get you married. Duchy of Portugal. Now that is incredibly useful. Yeah, let's do that. I mean, he could also be a target, but no. Let's do this. Although they won't have any claims, apparently. And it'll be three years before you actually get married, but that's going to be okay. Send proposal. Actually get a decent alliance. The quarrel? Ghost Girl and Fletcher Reed have been quarreling for days? Come on! How can the spawn of hell like you believe that the ideal manifestation of extra life family virtues? Clearly more deserving. No fighting. We break up the fight or we let them fight. But we gain a ton of stress. No, no fighting. I think we'll have to pick sides here in a sec. Did I not do the patrol? Hang on. Maybe it just hasn't responded yet. I walk into the room. Ghost girl turns to face you. I'm glad you're here. Golvoro, won't you please... You should call me father. Come on. Won't you please talk some sense into your son? Completely unreasonable. Shame on you. You're in the wrong. Both acting like petulant children. Oh, almost guaranteed to listen to reason and give me some diplomacy lifestyle. Or I could do this. But no, let's do that. There you go. There you go. Betrothal accepted. Excellent. Uh, we still have to wait for positive money, so we'll just fast forward right now. I'm not going to develop the capital right now, because I'm way too stressed. I don't have money for hunts and things. I know I can declare war. Well, I mean, I might immediately go into debt. Okay, hold on. Are they seriously sieging out my household? Well, I can't raise my troops now, because my dudes would get insta-booped. You're rescinding my spy master. Come on, man. I, and I got 32. Like, get, let me be your steward. There you go. Head of faith for gold. Yes, please. Although the timing's a little awkward because I don't want to raise my troops right now. I'm just hoping I don't get kidnapped. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Courture killed, killed, killed. So we got some positions available. I do have another perk I can grab. 
I won't go down here for now, because I don't think it matters too much. Isn't our Chancellor pretty good? We'll run you in. Do I want to switch to domestic affairs? No, I don't really have vassals to care about, so the foreign affairs is still correct. I guess we're going to chill until this war ends. We lose county control again? Yeah, I mean, I guess probably because we were sieged. Can I increase? No, I can't because we don't control it. Maybe, maybe it's they have low control there. Maybe that's going to reset soon. I don't know. But yeah, I'm not going to do anything right now. We're just going to sit and chill. Wait for this war to go over. And then see who we can declare on. Hopefully that this is going to open up some vulnerabilities. Hey, glory is widely known. Loyalty or fear. Generous liege. Right, none of this really matters. The king already respects me to the max. So I guess I'll do this. I don't think the money matters too much. What is this? Shady discussion. Passing through Castle Gardens for a morning walk when soft breeze carries the voices of Argilo and Rodrigo. Talking to each other, secluded spot. Hard for me to make out. Clear discussion relates to the mayor. I could warn the mayor. Which would make one of my vassals like me more. You know what? Let's do the intrigue challenge. Get close without noticing me. Discussing mayor's private life and some unsavory habits. Oh, she's a non-believer. Now that's very interesting. So my vassal, I now have a secret on my vassal. Now, if I blackmail, is that going to lead to... Yeah, I'm forgiving. Could expose the hook. Is there some other interaction I could do? And if I do this, they would gain stress. Well, I'm not trying to black... What? Yeah, because I'm trying to expose. I'm not... It's weird. It says blackmail, but I'm not actually blackmailing here. I'm just straight out exposing, which doesn't look like it's going to generate me stress. Um, I don't know if there's a reason to do this, though. Hey, child of my dynasty. Wutrax really likes name people after the dynasty, but we're going to override that and go with Radical! Still feel like we are, like... Got to be like two thirds female heirs. Cast wait, Caster's in prison. Oh, she's being held by the Sultan. Well, that's not great. So they did kidnap. They actually grabbed a lot of people, including Tasty Sauerkraut. Okay, the war is over. Did that cause these to be released, or are they still ransomed? allows seizure of counties required to create an oh I misinterpreted what that does oh shit that's really good okay so you do bend the knee over here but is that really is that really going to be fine I also got a claim so that's a hundred that's 350 because I guess it's a freebie so really, I, I want to use the fact that I've got a claim on this. Do I got a stat on how many troops you're going to bring in? Oh, so I can bring in the king. It's going to cost me a lot. Let's do it. Let's make sure this goes okay. I will lead. Thank you for joining. It looks like it's going to be fine. Which I'm a little bit surprised about. But we'll take it. 
and I don't mind having spent the uh, prestige as a just in case. Just in case I misunderstood something. No, okay. Oh! Oh! I didn't realize I was in the UMADs, which is interesting. So I'm in the UMADs so I can call in the king because it's not an internal war all of a sudden. Oh. Oh. Wait. Huh. I didn't realize that that... I didn't... I never bothered to check what that last war was. And he's going to demand conversions. Um... Or, I said inversion. I mean conversion. Do I? Do I want to become Muslim? I kind of don't want to. But I also kind of want to. I mean, maybe we can have a much bigger dynasty this way. More wives? Right? You know, I've never played CK3 Muslim. Screw it, let's do it! I know, I talked about, like, not, you know, we just wanted to play the sort of standard vanilla experience. Nah, screw this. Let's do it. Secondary spouses. Yeah. Um, potential alliances? Sure. Let's do that. Anyone with uh, genetic traits? Not many, but... There you go. Done. Alright, let's get started that way. See what shakes out next. Alliance is formed. Okay. Alright, accept my hand in marriage. Good. Um, you're... A l let, let's just go out and say a little young, maybe. Just a, a tiny little bit here. Um, so there's no one else with a genetic trait. Might still be worth getting another just to try to be fruitful and multiply, right? Or we could wait for more things to to pop out. Maybe we'll just wait. We'll check again. It's possible, you know, new new courtiers and things get generated all the time. So we're, we're not going to get any new nobles, but yeah, let's see here. So as soon as the siege is done, we will 100%. And call in people in the war. I can, uh, so the Sheik, so, uh, wow. So Tui, hold on. This actually might not be too bad. All right, 100%, enforce demands, go. You, Sh Diago, I don't even know if this is, that's not the same Rodrigo as before, okay. Yeah, Infante's still different. But I can declare war and retake Tui, and actually I'll be able to make my... Um... Oh, I can't do it with my troops, though. I'll be able to make my duchy. I've got claims. I'll declare war. I'll raise my armies. I could call in allies, but I don't think we're going to have to. Yeah, I mean, that seems okay. You didn't call in anyone. Oh, you did call in an ally. Oh, up over here. But I'm going to be able to smash the initial troops here. Because they're still gathering. They might group up. Okay, well then, never mind. Hold on. I don't know what it's saying is going to be balanced. They did have some pretty good quality troops. But there you go. Get smashed. I put myself back in charge again. And we're going to smash these guys. You know, this is the best thing to happen to us. Holy cow! Oh, we do have the low county control. Let's get those fixed up, please. Let's rebuild Santiago. Because, yeah, the uh, population here are are still Catholic. Let's do some conversions. Um, promote culture to Castilian. Well, the population... Oh, they're Castilian there, but not here. Unless I just become Galician? You know, I'm, I'm not entirely sure what I want to do culture-wise. I'm just going to get you to keep collecting taxes for now. But yeah, man. Let's go! A 
Iberian Muslims adapted to realities of ruling over a region with a large Christian and Jewish population. So what are our things? We are adaptive. To so opinion, different faith isn't as big of a deal. Um, county conversion resistance has increased. Infidel vassals are less likely to join independent populist factions. Struggle and submission. When exists, the head of the faith can declare holy war. Right, okay. Uh, just, yeah, domain taxes for different faith has increased. We get more troops in the same faith, but less of another. Virtues are temperate, generous, just. Sins are arbitrary. That's not going to be good for, um, for sauerkraut. Greedy and gluttonous. And being a drunkard is bad. Male dominated pluralist Sunni. Teachings of the Prophet. Non Islamic faiths with the Islamic syncretic considered evil. Or hostile instead of evil. Uh huh. Same sex is accepted. Polygamy, divorce. No bastards. Okay. All right. Getting a bit of a sense of what we're going to be dealing with here. Would be nice to have some siege equipment. Uh, once I become a duke, I think I get my man at arm limit goes up. So let's unlock a new CB here. Because that might be relevant once we get our duke title. They're desperately having to defend because they know they're going to 100% presumably if they uh, lose this location. But they're not going to gain anything here. Still, I'm really hoping to get some, gain some military traits. I can ransom someone for money. Not much money, but let's ransom right away. Negative money during the war. Because of our men at arms, but that's going to be okay. Oh, lines expired. Empty council position. Chancellor, kick the bucket once more. <sighs> Ten, you're already assigned somewhere else. Yeah, alright. So, like, we got sixes, that's it. So we may as well give it to a powerful vassal of some sort. Um... So I don't really care who. I mean, I guess I could put you positive. If I do that. Sure, fine. New combatants captured. Alright. My wife is pregnant. One of my wives, anyway. Do do do. Prisoner taking in siege. So some of my families are still out there being Catholics. And here's the thing, right? When we die, well. I don't think anyone else has landed anywhere else. But at some point, we might take over as our Catholic branch. Known for a dedication to the faith. I mean, you know, we're new to it, but we're eager. Um, I will call a hunt. And could we make a title? Actually, maybe less so because I just... Yeah, we can create the duchy. Okay, we'll, uh, we'll come back to that in a second here. Still worth doing that hunt. Rampaging boar. Oh yeah, I might die. Weak hook. And friends of animals. 20 years. Yeah, that might have expired. Hey, we have a new daughter. So, we're going to grab a new name from the spreadsheet. And it's going to be... Klapos! Klapos, welcome to the family. Woo! You are smart. Excellent. Okay. Oh, I'm now a novice hunter. What does that do for us? Plus two prowess. Increased stress loss. That's very good. Any new spouses got, uh... You have claims. Hello. Hold on. Okay. Some proposal. <gasps> Daughter-in-law gave birth to two children! Okay. Name number one is Ushikin. Name number two is going to be Bunisher. You know what? I'm so happy we converted. This is going to be so much fun. Can I like right click and ransom this way? Yeah, let's let's get um, let's get Tasty Sauerkraut because he's our heir. And like, well, I mean, really, things are going to get split up. But let's start with that. We're going to need some money for things. I should really uh, get everyone. Okay, we're married here. Um, I'm going to hold off on the feast. Here, let me turn off the check mark for that. Re-enable it for the hunt. 
it going to be 50 for each one of these? Oh no, 10. It must be a gender thing. Benign vassal. Like you should you should just like release them. Since I'm I'm all team you now. There we go. Extra life can marry, which is what we're looking for. So we can still match a lineal. Good. So, like, maybe matrilineal with people who have claims. Like that. Excellent. Now, spending that money is slowing down our duchy creation, which is annoying as hell. Let's try not to die before we create the duchy. Oh, we become friends with this prince. I love it! Okay! Friends it is! We have lots of benefits when we're friends with people. New liege. Alright, someone died. What's in the name? No, 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 no. We have to do some, uh... Spreadsheeting. It's gonna be... Okay, so Matthew. Matthew Clementson. I'm just gonna use Matthew. Welcome to the family. And thank you very much for your support of Extra Life. Cradled by sickness. No, Matthew, no! Don't die. Steward. Steward! Steward? I mean, we'll say yes, of course. We'll get extra money and prestige and things. Marital recriminations. What's happening? Surprised to find my wife skulking in my study. By looking at her face, something's clearly upsetting her. Yet, it takes me a while to convince her to share her concerns with me. My beloved must confess that Rodrigo has gravely insulted me. I cannot bear the thought of being close to that coarse man anymore. He'll be gone tomorrow. Banished from the realm. Oh, he's unlight. He landed. Okay. I'm going to be overreacting. Why not you tell me everything from the start? Intrigue challenge. I learned whether she's sincere. Demand to take action. Well, let's do the intrigue challenge and see what happens. He doesn't have much money. Because I think if we banish him, we get the money. But he doesn't have that much. Let's do the challenge. Even after discussing details of the incident with Plasencia, I'm unsure as what to think of the whole affair. Good sheik which should stand by his sheikah. Yet I cannot shake the feeling that Plasencia might be telling the whole story. I can talk to him. Should forget this whole matter. Well, let's go have a chat. What happened over here? Sultan of Galicia. Um, with my mind set on a relaxing evening, I'm heading for my wife Layla's chambers with some violet sharba and a chest set. Without knocking, I push her door open. Sheikha Layla is seated by her desk, writing furiously. As I clear my throat, she jumps out of her skin. She quickly stuffs a roll of parchment into our pocket and turns towards me with an uneasy look upon your face. What are you hiding? Show me at once. Return later and search her chambers in secret. Respect her privacy. I don't want to search. That's just, that's just rude. No. I, I, I want to find out what you're hiding here. Did she really think I would not see that? Give it to me, at once. With a shivering hand, she offers me the crumpled parchment. I skim the letter, horrified. It is convincing accusation, claiming Layla is a sexual deviant. Oh, she's gay. Ha! <laughs> Whoops. Uh, all right. Well, that, I mean, again, it's not impossible for us to have kids. I mean, you literally have had one. A primary spouse divorce. I should just divorce you. All family members of her. Uh, I guess, can I expose the secret? And then maybe use that as a basis for things? It's mean. It's cruel. I'm really surprised it still has the same penalties here. Well, we gotta divorce her now. Maybe we'll have to be a little bit more picky as we go forward. Yeah, there's not a lot of options. Eh. Well, no, I still want to make babies. You're straight. That's good. There. We can go hunting together. Hold on. Wait. What? Oh, you have a different religion than mine. I mean, it might not matter too much, but how about you? 
What is this? Disputed heritage. I don't think that matters. Done. I do want to create the Duchy of Galicia. I'm losing piety sort of sucks, but I don't think it's hurting us too much. We do have a lot of land. We're well within our holdings, which is nice. Not making much money these. Oh, um, okay, yeah, you're still increasing this. You're still converting. You're going to do the taxes, which is exactly what I want. Domestic affairs. How many vassals do I have? I do have a few more now. But I think we're still kind of okay. Pedro does have a 12 learning. That doesn't really help us, though. Yeah. Um, okay, you have a 13 diplomacy. Well, Tasty Sauerkraut. Oh, Tasty Sauerkraut's back. You're va oh, you're not a powerful vassal. That's why you weren't high up in the list. But no, I want to put Tasty Sauerkraut back in here. I don't care if you're unhappy. Let's get him back in this role. That's going to be really good. Yeah, low control. Designated Guardian. Sure. We'll see what kind of warfare we can do soon. Yeah, the plan I think is going to be create the duchy, and then I think that'll open up some new CBs for us. Okay, well, this series is certainly turking, taking a turn that I did not expect, but it is going. France is in kind of rough shape over here. Byzantine Empire still doing fine, it looks like. The Tale of Two Bavarias. It's the Duke of Bavaria and the Kingdom of Bavaria. Well, that's very interesting. All right. I don't know if I've seen that before. Abbasid's still doing pretty good. And then we are in an interesting, interesting position. I think it's going to do good things for us. We'll see. Who knows? Maybe this won't be the last time we convert a religion. Thanks for watching, folks. I'm going to see you guys next time. Bye-bye.